Yo, what's up, guys? It's Awesome Carter 23 here, and welcome back to another game maker tutorial video. I know, I know, you're gonna say, yeah, you're kind of happy because I'm back from another game maker tutorial, and I totally miss this game maker, also the tutorials and all the stuff. Yeah, I am totally miss this one, and since I forgot all about this, I'm going to get the Clash of Clans to be back soon. And you're gonna be guys happy and so today guys but we're not doing a clash of clans 2d we're going to do a league of legends tutorial well you know what's the league of legends right and we're gonna make it on game ma game maker but for me it's not very accurate to the original game we're gonna make it you know how they do how they do you know the gameplay you know like respawns all the stuff the power-ups and skills and everything all the player how did they do it well I'm going to show you how like you know a MOBA game well that how that's how the game works so first of all I just make a player with a circle but we're going to improve that in the other tutorials we're just going to have an example so it, so it's not that hard to make you know a sprite so that's why we make a sprite player so let's go click OK on that it's you know let's make it a cube but I I prefer to have a circle on the player so let's create an object real quick and object player. So the, in this tutorial also we're going to we're going to do some player player moves. Yeah, yeah. This is the whole basic stuff of all the game. The movement of the player, of course, of course, everybody knows that. So here are the create because I'm gonna add some animation soon. So we're gonna say image create this equal to zero. Just just that stuff. Also with the step. Uh, so this is the basic step because it's a top-down 2D. I'm gonna make it a top-down 2D, so it's kind of easier, easier to code. So we're gonna say if keyboard shift. Oh wait, let's go with the plus. I'll make it org. Uh, let's use a WASD. So remember, if you wanna put a you know, if you want to customize, you know, with the letters, using letters, you know, you need to put the ORD, meaning that's the key, what's, this the key, so, so, right here, and two brackets, you know, close, open and close, if you guys remember that, and, I guess say, uh, oh, wait, Y plus two equals to five, it's easy, you know, it's easy, so copy, multiple times make it as the a make this as the x this will be minus 5 and make this s for um, y will be upward uh, oh I think I'm wrong this might be on top and this will way down and the d is going to the right so simple as it looks so that's cool that's cool I'm gonna make a player and add an event. Well, we don't need an event yet because <laughs> we're still starting. So I'm gonna make this the room more a bit smaller because I don't want you know I love small. No. Oh wait, put the room. Make this a game and put the player in the middle. And if we run it, of course it will work. But this is the basic tutorial for if you want to learn something the basics of the game maker try here I, it's even though it's a lol it's a lol tutorial it's still basic in here so it's moving but I'm just pressing it so I think I'm wrong let's make this keyboard checked only because he will stop if I released it because you need that press so here we go this will work so I have here the, the circle, but oh no, I'm outside the room. We're gonna fix that by making a sprite. Make a sprite wall. So um, why am I saying this? Because it's basic, you know. You need to make we need to make this tutorial a basic one. So by doing this, uh, let's go for a green. Green, make this a green. That's a wall, but we're gonna improve it. Don't worry. 
to make another object with a bowling ball thingy or you can go with the folder right clicking it click create object but there are two ways or many ways you can to make this object wall make this solid and sprite wall in the sprite uh, we need to make it solid of course make it solid <laughs> to make the opposite to make the object solid also make us uh, uh, add an event for the player collision with the wall and you know what's the meaning of collision right so put your code and say x plus equal to zero uh oh yeah x plus equal to zero and y plus equal o plus equal to zero that's it so if we make a wall yeah that will work so yeah i think i'm gonna select oh add multiple shift and control oh wait <laughs> i'm wrong go with the wall Oh. Shift control. Oh. Don't wanna waste time. Wanna make you know. Nah. Don't worry guys. I need to make this smaller so you can guys see the tutorial. But in other tutorial I'm gonna make this larger so we can make more, you know, turrets, the base of the thing is and of all the stuff we can make so this the player i think i'm gonna put it right here because we're going to make here the opponent's base and the player's base you know what i mean and it's just like league of legends see? so if we run the game hopefully the player will stuck in the wall you know there you go yeah there you go so it's now colliding and we collide he will stop uh, that's pretty good okay so we make a player right now so not by that we're gonna make the wall you know more of you know it's like a game more like a game so make this uh, wall here we can make a passageway so uh, here's a thingy here and then we will put the thing here so this is like the mid base, the bottom base, you know. Yeah, let's make up. Uh, shift. Wait, wait, wait. Control. Okay. Okay. So we will make this, you know, the bottom base, and this might be the mid base or the top base. And this is the base, the base, you know, we have the turrets all over the place. But we're going to make that soon enough. And yes, we're going to make it. So, so, if we run this, we can make our brand new old minimap. Well, we, we have we have called that minimap because, yeah, it's a little bit, it's not a big map though. So, we're going to make here some other monsters here so you can farm you know what I mean in like the mobile legends so wait oh wait I'm stuck oh no I'm stuck but we're gonna fix that soon enough so here's the top base and voila voila with, with the right click in it oh, oh. <laughs> so my plans here was if the player if the player if you click the you know the left click if you click the left click you know what I mean he's gonna attack you know he's gonna attack uh, I think with the laser thingies and all this stuff so he can attack also with the opponents I think I need the AI but I'm gonna learn some things we're gonna learn something about the AI soon because you need a opponent you know if you need opponents you need to use AI if you want like the opponent from the others you need to use service but we're gonna do that in the other tutorial so have your own minimap so this the mid base here right here what i'm moving on okay so this our top base and this might be our bottom base which is i'm stuck we're gonna fix that wait so we're gonna delete those and go with the objects go with the wall make this uh, like thing so i think this probably be it so this is our own mini map if we if you want guys so 
Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like it, please press the like button. If you want more League of Legends, we have other tutorial. If you guys like it, um, please press the like button. Yeah, share this video if you want. If you want to share the, if you want to share this to others and learn them how to program, and subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification if you want be updated with my channel thank you guys so much for watching i'll see you guys in another tutorial so see ya